Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So should we try on some clothes? I think we will. This is going to be a cup she try on haul of uh, some things that I've been sent recently. So if you want to see how clothes look on a body like mine, then keep watching. So hi everyone. I hope you're all feeling well today. I am... I'm getting quite excited now in the rundown to Christmas when I'm filming this, it's the 21st of December and I am a giddy gipper because this is Mark's last day uh, today. He has been working in the office in Manchester this week rather than working at home because obviously the kids have finished now and um, I am trying to catch up with him if I can so hopefully we can finish roughly at the same time. I will still have work to do for the rest of the week but still it's so exciting knowing that he's going to be home. So that is the reason for my good mood. Um, but today as I mentioned in the intro I have another cup she try on video for you. I worked with him earlier on this year um, in that swimwear video which um, if you are like a regular follower of mine I'm assuming you will have seen. The first time I discovered cup she was back in the wit half term i wanted a swimming costume to go to center parts with and i ended up purchasing one of Gupshi's swimsuits it's the one with the scallop detail a lot of people have it and it's such a nice swimsuit and it's still one of my go-to's to this day took it on holiday with me as well when we went abroad absolutely love it and um obviously i tried on some more swimsuits but this video is going to be more about the autumn wintery kind of wardrobe and just to show what they have available if it might be of interest to you um so when we talk about body types again i um i would consider myself to be quite curvy i've weighed more i've weighed less um and i'm trying to get to a stage now where i really do take heed of the fact that my body is the least interesting thing about me and my weight like who cares what I weigh or what you weigh or anything like that we, I just I just purely want to feel comfortable and good in the clothes that I wear um I have things in my wardrobe that range anywhere from a 12 to an 18 depending on whether or not I've got away with a certain type of fit or whether I want it more oversized and we're all I, th I think that's one thing I'm really learning in my 30s that I need to stop defining myself by a number that's on the on a tag on the back of my neck or on my like the back of my trousers or something because I spent years equating that to like my self-worth and my value and the smaller that number was the better I thought I would feel and that is not true um so I mean they're a little bit of a body pep talk but let's get on to the clothes the first thing is the one that I'm wearing and I absolutely love this i'm gonna do what i did last time in my try on video and i will show you on screen but i will also do a vertical cutaway so you can see it um you know in full length and um, just because i feel like that gives you a better view of what like not only the quality is like but also how it looks on a body like mine so this is a big fleecy half zip hoodie basically it has pockets but not a pouch it has a hood i love the fair isle print i love the fleeciness it's so cozy and snuggly and i i just this is my favorite thing that when i was flicking through the first thing that i, I like was like oh i love that was this um and when everything arrived it was the first thing that i put on it's just so soft and it's really roomy as well like i tend to buy things like this like bigger than the size that i am so i can have all of this because this makes me feel comfy and cozy and like i can go oh like a little i don't know hamster or something hibernating do hamsters hibernate probably not a good example a woodland creature if you will yeah this is probably one of my favorite things just purely because you know when you find something that you'll just get loads of wear out of and i think at this time of year this kind of print and pattern is lovely and it's great to throw on um with like some leggings or some beats and go on a dog walk with like your coat and a hat and that kind of thing um and i just really like it so that's the first thing so what i've actually paired with this is what i'm going to show you next now they're on my body um and i don't i'm a bit conscious of just shoving my like bottom half in the camera but it's a pair of ribbed leggings and these are so comfy you know the sort that really really hold you in but they stay up for starters they're not always falling down they're really like snug and i feel like supported 
but I don't feel like I've been cut into in any way and they're so thick and you can't see my underwear which is the main thing with leggings because I just prefer to wear them most of the time like I will wear jeans on occasion but usually I will wear like my leggings or my flares that I love to wear and um, these are really good quality so, so this is how they're cut and as you can see they have this really flattering like V shape and they are so so comfy and i just love them but obviously the cutaway will show them in a lot better way than what i just did then um but really good quality they have loads of like active wear actually and um i think i might have a look again you know just to see what other colors they have because i'm really pleased with these then the next one that i have to show you is a similar type um of top in that it's fleecy um it's so fluffy uh, fluffy it's almost like like teddy berry um, and this is a two-tone like jacket but it's not a hood but it is um a half zip again and it kind of makes me think of a polar bear but again this i just thought it'd be really cute with like uh leggings trainers maybe um my gilet that i've got and like if i'm going on a dog walk you know when it's not that super super freezing weather and um, but you still want to be cozy and again it's just so soft and it's one of those as well where it's fluffy on the inside and it's fluffy on the outside and um again this is just something that i'll get a lot of wear out of i find that in the colder months i just love oversized hoodies jumpers things like that and i just like to make sure that i'm as comfortable and as warm as possible so this is another one that i really really liked now the next thing is also a jumper but this is more of um like a smarter one it depends on what mood i'm in so i'll wear like knitwear when I feel like being a little bit, I don't know, more put together, I suppose. And then I wear hoodies and things like this where I just want to have a really cozy day. I've got loads on and that kind of thing. But this is gorgeous. What I really liked about this is that it has like the slightly balloon sleeve, the slightly wider. Um, it has this cute little like, not quite a tit on it, but I do quite like a higher neck on me. And then what is also really nice is that it's gathered here at the hips so it kind of billows out slightly and i find that that can be really good cut if you're wanting to avoid like showing off your tummy like i've had three children to say that my tummy is flat would be a lie <laughs> i mean like you've seen me in all these videos my body's not perfect by any means but i do like to try and dress to sort of show off my best bits if you know what i mean and i thought this was really really cute i love the brown shade i think it's a nice like transitional one for like autumn and winter and um i just think it's a nice little staple because it's a bit of a basic you could pair it with like jeans you can pair it with like the flared trousers that i like to wear a lot um and you can dress it up or down but I thought that was really cute the next thing that i have to show you is a dress um and this is kind of like a really thin sort of cottony knit it's very soft i really wish you could feel this actually because it's it's lovely and soft now this has again a kind of sleeve that i like where it's like a bit of a bell sleeve and it's cuffed as well so it's floaty but then like comes in at your wrist which is really flattering and nice and um this is kind of like again a bit of a crew neck and then it's more of a skater dress so it's fitted more up top and then the skirt here um is slightly tiered and again this is one that will translate better you know in the cutaway um but i just thought it was a really nice one because quite an easy one say if you were taking it from day to night um you could dress it up by changing your shoes and stuff i would wear like thick opaque tights with these probably boots and then like maybe like a little coat or cardigan in fact i have like a kind of jacket that i think would pair really really well with this so i will show you that next so this is the jacket this is a really lightweight and this is what i liked about it and why i chose it it's a lightweight teddy jacket and it's one that you can kind of throw over and layer which i really like because i have a really really thick winter coat um but sometimes it's almost too thick and like on some days where it is milder like it is at the moment we, we're no longer in the below freezing <laughs> where i live um sometimes it's almost too much and i like to layer and be able to take things on and off as when i need to and i thought this would be actually a really nice one to put over dresses on a night out in autumn winter because it is thinner but it'll obviously still add a lot of warmth it has a little button at the front just a singular one and um 
it's just really nice really really nice like lovely like despite it being a thinner um jacket it's still really nice quality and again i love just that like whole teddy vibe it just makes me feel so cozy so i think again would look really nice with that dress on a night out with like maybe the warm hair extensions and my little like heeled boots and stuff i think that would be really cute and then speaking of nights out i have two dresses i would actually say that these are both very festive and um i was quite excited to see these because i have a certain style of dress that i love on me um but sometimes it can be a little bit harder to find depending on the time of year but this is the first one this is like a maxi it's a beautiful green shade i really really like this color green on me i have green eyes so i feel like it helps them to come out a little bit and makes them pop and it has a shared bodice but a higher neck it has again these um poofy sleeves which are cuffed which i just think are gorgeous and then a long tiered skirt and i think this with like some gold heels um and like gold hoops and stuff i just think it would be so beautiful it's quite like a classy one um and i just was really excited to try this on um so yeah that is the dress and then i have one more dress to show you one kind of fabric for me that always makes me think of christmas is tartan and if you follow me like on instagram you will know that like one of my favorite styles of dresses is again like that shared um tart it has the like milkmaidy cut and that's like a midi skirt now this not only has like a bow as well but it's the cut of dress i love and it is so <laughs> festive and i'm always like i feel like this might be a Christmas day dress contender because it's so cute and it's a little bit different. It's definitely more out there. It's very, I'm in a Hallmark movie. Am I Lindsay Lohan now? I don't know. Have you seen that new Lindsay Lohan Christmas movie on Netflix? You'll have to let me know. We watched it. Um, but it's just given me that kind of vibe. And when I saw it, I just thought, I've got to try that on. I've got to at least try that on. And um, it is pretty cute. It's very extra, but it's very cute. And then finally, as you'll probably know, Cupshe does like loads of swimwear. It's not the season for swimwear where I live, obviously, because um, it was like minus seven the other week. Um, and it's a little, it's a lot milder today, actually, but I'm still not getting my uh, swimwear out yet. But um, they also do, obviously, clothing, as I've showed you, which changes with the season. They've always got new stuff. But they also do like a few accessories as well. And when I saw this hat, oh, it's cute. Now, I have a bit of a love-hate relationship with bobble hats because some of them, this bit can be too, like, big for my head, like, too long. So I get a really saggy bit on top, but this fits. But, oh, I feel so cute. It's such a nice fit on my head. I've got, like, a, 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 a big head, but it's not very long. Um, so some of them, like, when I wear them, they'll be like this on me or just really saggy at the top, which I don't like. So that is actually really nice quality. And the pom-pom's really nice quality as well. Like super fluffy faux fur. I really like that. Really pleased with that. I know it sounds really silly, but like if you if you have a big head like me, you'll know like hat problems are a real thing. Like, oh my gosh, I struggle with summer hats so badly. But anyway, they do things like this and this is super cute, nice and neutral, which I love. And um, I'm actually really chuffed with how that fits. So that's a win. So yeah, that is everything. I hope you found that useful. And I also have an exclusive discount code for you, which I will leave on screen now and also a link in the description bar. So if there is anything that takes you fancy or you do fancy like having a nosy in general, make sure you keep that code to hand and save yourself some money if you are going to buy anything because um every little helps at this time of year but thank you so much for watching and thank you for all your love and support as always because it means a lot to me take care and i will see you next time